A mountain ridge of garbage mars the beauty of this beach in Ghana. One of the chief culprits? Textile waste from industrialized nations in the West. But how does it get there? Call it the unintended consequences of charity. Used clothing is donated. The United States is the world's chief exporter of secondhand clothes. That clothing is shipped to places like Ghana. Each week, an estimated 15 million items of used clothing arrive in this market in Ghana's capital, Accra. The garments are packed in large bales, which traders buy for anywhere from $25 to $500. They don't know exactly what's in them, so it's a gamble every time. But they'll try to resell what they can to make a profit. The people in the market have a name for these old duds, which one trader shared with CBS News's Deborah Pata, dead white man's clothes. Dead man fight clothes. Hi. <laughs> You'd have to have died to have given away so many clothes. Some of those dead white man's clothes can be repurposed, but a lot of it isn't good for much, said designer and activist Sammy Otang. Before, they used to have like good quality clothes, but now there's a lot of trash and a lot of like very low quality clothes. The whole fast fashion module is built around like, you know, building cheap clothing. It's clothing, popular in many wealthy countries, that's not meant to last. Waste is being built into the model of uh, fast fashion. You know, like overproduce, overproduce, overproduce. And then in the end, like people wear clothes for just like two weeks and then just discard them. The waste does not end up in America. Ultimately, it ends up here in Cantamanto. And what can't be used ends up as garbage, lots of it. Garbage that gets washed onto the beaches or that finds its way to towering landfills. Landfills like this one, made of old textiles, can emit toxic fumes. So you can see the brands. When you come here, you see a whole lot of brands. Adidas, H&M, Zara. So basically, this is where dead white men's clothes go yes, to die. Yes, in the end, yes. A reminder that the things we throw away or donate don't just go away. This is Inside Edition Digital.